For going, the blast was consistent with a gas explosion, most likely LPG. One week after the deadly explosion in two Surendra that killed three and injured four, Interior Secretary Mar Rojas confirms the blast was caused by a gas leak. The source, liquefied petroleum gas, or LPG, according to the interagency investigation. To Surendra, a posh enclave in Taguig City, uses a centralized piped-in gas system. Bonifacio Gas Corporation supplies LPG to the building and other properties of Bonifacio Global City. Professor C.P. David, a geoscientist, explains the team arrived at the conclusion the blast was consistent with a gas explosion because of four factors. There was minimal post-explosion residue, no crater, an instantly dissipated flame, minimal charring, and a pressure wave. But Rojas says they have yet to find out what ignited the explosion or where the leak came from. He also does not say who was liable for the blast, but says Angelito San Juan, who was renting apartment 501B, appears to have behaved normally. Uh, I think right now all we are prepared to say is gas explosion. Kung bakit nangyari ito, negligence, incompetence, uh, uh, fraud, o ano ba, hindi pa namin sinasabi. So, hindi pa, hindi pa nagsimula yung ito. <laughs> Ang masasabi lang namin ay uh, likely gas explosion. Dr. David adds only a small amount of gas is needed to ignite a blast as powerful as the Surrender explosion. He says three factors are needed, fuel, air, and ignition. A perfect mix of three spells the recipe for disaster. He says something as simple as a light switch can cause the explosion. There is a specific mixture of my air and my flammable material. In the case of propane, it is 2 to 10 percent mix. No? 2 to 10 percent of the gas and 90 to 98 percent air. That is the perfect mix at which your material can explode and cause fire. Gas leaks are usually detected because of a foul smell caused by an additive, more captain. But a source tells Rappler the gas used by Surendra was odorless. This, despite a statement on BGC's website, it uses an odorant for safety. If proven the gas was odorless, BGC may be liable for the deadly blast. But with no one yet to blame, all eyes are on the gas supplier and how they will explain the leak turned nightmare. Natasha Gutierrez, Rappler, Manila.